Welcome to Cheap Controls. We make videos on things that we struggled with, hoping to help you so you don't. Consider subscribing and hitting that bell. In this video I'm going to go over the send me command. I thought I had done a video on this before but I can't seem to find it. I get questions about it from time to time and this will make it easy for me just to refer to something. So I'm doing it plus, and as I said earlier, I'm just getting back into things. So I thought oh, this would be a fairly easy video to start with and for the second one. We're going to go ahead and start in the Arduino. The code for this is pretty simple. Um, the top line there is that N character where I just set it to the 0FF, so I have to type it over and over again. We're going to have two integers, and the code I'm going to use is what's being sent from the Nexion when you, when you request the page. And if you remember back when we were doing the union in the last example, it would send a 70 or a 71 depending on whether it was a value or a text, and that was in the get command. Well, this sends a different code, and then we're also going to have an integer for the page number. The setup's pretty simple. We're just going to set a serial begin, because all we're going to be doing is using the send me command. In the loop, I set up my DFD, or data from display, and then I do a loop that's very familiar by now, I would think, where we do if serial is available, we're going to get the DFD, or get the characters from the Nexion, one at a time, and once we've got the three FFs, the final characters or the end characters, then we're going to do something with that. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to strip off the first character, and that'll be the code. And then the next character will be the page. If you remember from the last video, we would look at four characters because it would be a long. But in this case, it does just send one character for the page number. And then we're going to clear out the DFD. We're going to put a little delay in there. I, I really don't think I need it for this one, but I threw it in there. And then we're going to print out the page number and a colon, and then we're going to print out that code too, just so you can see what the code is. I'm going to switch over to the Nexion now. Now on the Nexion, what I have is I have three pages. And on the first page, I have page one, page two, which take me to page one and page two. And then on each page, I'm going to have this button info, and it's just going to execute the command send me and what that will do is out the serial port it will provide the current page number that we're on. I'm going to run this in debug. If you click down here on the MCU input I only have one COM port on right now so I know it's the Arduino and then you hit start. When I press the button info, I'm going to be executing the send me command, and we're going to, down here you'll see it's sending the page number to the Arduino, and then we should get a reply. So the first byte is at 66, which is the code that says this is a send me, and then the second number is the page number, and then followed by the FFs. So I'm going to switch this over to string, and you see we get page 0. And then that 0 or 102 is hex for 66. And if we go to another page and I send it, we're sending page 1. I'm returning page 1 with the same code. And if I go to page 2 and hit it, we're sending the 66 with the 0, 02. So it's, it's behaving just as we thought it would. I'm going to go back to the Arduino, and we're going to send the send me from the Arduino. We're going to send it every five seconds. OK, so now we're back over to the Arduino. I'm going to change this delay to 5,000. And then for the serial, I'm going to change this, uncomment it. So now we're going to send the send me. But I think I have to have line, because I want a carriage return at the end of it. So we're going to serial print line send me plus the end character. Now when we go back, every five seconds, we'll send the send me to the Nexion, and then the Nexion is going to send back a character, hopefully the page number, and then we're going to reply with that page number. So I'm going to start it. I'm going to send the send me YY, and then it 
applied with it and we got the page zero and you can see we'll get page zero over and over and over now when I go to page one now we get page one here and it should reply over here with page one and we get page one reply I'm gonna go back and we'll go to page two And now we got page two. And we should get it over here. Here, There we go, page two. So we're able to receive everything. I do wonder why when I send that page two, we're not getting an error over here. Well, that's about it for this video. If you like what you saw, consider giving me a thumbs up, and also consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching.